Hi, I'm Sarah Shepherd, and welcome to my weekly Terrascopes. Hi there, welcome to this week's Terrascopes for the week of the 3rd of August to the 9th of August. Hope you're having a great week. There's a full moon tonight, so hopefully you're not all there howling at the moon. If anybody's a little bit off and a little bit moody, then I'm hoping I've just explained it. You know that the moon affects moods and it affects attitudes. So, yeah, if someone's being weird, just give them a bit of a wide berth today. Anyway, let's begin. Aries, there's a reflective time for you at the moment. You're looking back to see how far you've come because that's the only reason you should be looking back you should be proud of what you've achieved it took a lot to get where you are so yeah look back at times but only as a measurement okay not somewhere that you want to go back to Taurus Taurus you've got to put your foot down mate people are not doing things as they should be doing them and somebody needs to take control things won't be done if we just all blame it on each other be the big person get in in there and just say come on everybody rally around the troops and let's get it done gemini let's watch your budget here mrs or mister there's it's coming in as fast as it's going out and it's catching up with you i think you need to start saving for a rainy day and looking a bit ahead more so that these surprises don't catch you unawares okay let's have a little rainy day fun get a piggy bank cancer it's all very well having all these big ideas and all these big plans but it doesn't mean anything unless you do something about it put your money where your mouth is you've told everybody what you're going to do now you've got to do it actions speak louder than words leah i think you need to be planning a little trip i think you need a bit of a change of scenery you you've been here sitting it out for weeks and weeks and end and it's time to have a little getaway i don't know where I wouldn't suggest overseas, but yeah, let's let's go and have a day out, maybe to the coast, maybe somewhere different. Virgo, all your wishes can all come true right now. Please be careful what you wish for. Things can not appear to be as great as you thought once you get them. So you've maybe you've been wishing and wishing and wishing and once it gets here, it's not what you thought it was going to be. So yeah you won't have this time again so be careful with your wishes take it easy and make sure it's what you want libra time to speak up mate you've been put on too many times i nearly swore then i do apologize you can't take any more it's time to put your foot down it's time to put a stop to this nonsense tell people you've had enough you don't want this anymore okay i know you have it in you to do that so come on let's do it Scorpio you're a bit undecided at the moment as well you can't decide between two options they both look equally as good but you're being forced to make a decision make it on your terms do it how you want to do it but you can't avoid this decision I would make the decision before it's made for you Sagittarius bit down at the moment I think it's all been a little bit too much. Something's going on around you that you're finding it very hard to deal with. I wonder if it's happening to someone else rather than you. You've always been a supporter of the underdog. There's an injustice that you are struggling with. Please don't let it hurt you. Please don't stay down too long. If this is an injustice that we're fighting, where's the fight gone? Where's the fiery spirit? So come on, get up let's sort this out capricorn we seem to have come full circle with something every time you think you've solved this issue it comes up again we go round and round in circles and it really is time to break the cycle i don't know how you're going to do it but you need to even if it's just i don't know using a different washing powder i don't know something has to change you can't keep going round and round in circles aquarius time for change with you as well um this is your choice to change you need to i don't know do something different when you go out the front door go left instead of right you just different just change the scenery it seems to be a changeable week for everybody this week but yeah you you more than anyone aquarius just do something different do something in a different way brush your teeth before the shower i don't know something different pisces pisces 
very much like how Torian's over there. You need to take control. Everybody's flitting around and nothing's getting done. They need somebody to stand up, man up and say, come on, we're going to do it this way and this is it. Okay, I want you to find your inner bossiness and get everybody in order. If you don't do it, no one will do it and nothing will get done. I hope that makes sense to you. That's it for this week. If you would like a more private and personal reading, then you can go onto my Etsy store, Mystical Mayhem store, and you'll find all my readings available there. Or email me on sarahmysticalmayhem at hotmail.co.uk and we can sort something out. Okay, I've got a little bit of inspiration for you. It comes from the same book as last week. This lady is amazing. Laura Ding Edwards. And it's called Believe Me. Okay, and I think she's talking about depression. Believe me when I say your illness has an enemy. You have tools to help you beat it. Your own brand of therapy. You are wise to its behaviour. You have caught it out before. You can use your sword and armour when it's hammering your door. Don't leave it for tomorrow. Don't delay or hesitate. Admit your tripping, falling before you're down and it's too late. You know this beast, you've beat it. You can do it all once more. Take your army and your A-game and even up the score. Now that's fighting talk if I ever heard it and I think that's amazing, quite relevant for me right now with things that I'm dealing with and yeah, we're getting there. Okay, I hope you have a great week. Tell your people to share and follow our podcast and join our mailing list i didn't send out a newsletter last week i do apologize it was a bit of a hectic one but i'm trying to be consistent okay have a wonderful week be kind be safe look after each other be sensible doodles